Hello, guys. Hello, hello. <laughs> good morning, good morning, good morning. Uh, very early stream out of impromptu. I want to say thank you guys for stopping by. If you guys don't know who I am, my name is Frank Frangalos, and I stream every day or as often as possible, folks. Um, I thought we stream a little bit of Alden Ring today, and there's a build I've been wanting to work on. Uh, Intelligence Faith build, if you couldn't guess. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to do this whole playthrough on YouTube, but I thought I'd just start... You know, I'm playing anyway, right? So, might as well have an audience. Um, not sure how Baldur's build is going to work. And I'm... I ran into a couple calculators, so I think we're going to do... We're going to start with the Prophet. I thought I show off my character. Here he is. Um, as far as the name goes, I'm not sure yet. Um, but I think um, I think we'll name him after us. We'll call him Gallows. Mostly because I don't have a name. And as far as the keepsake goes, guys, I know everybody picks like Golden Seed. Uh, I was thinking maybe the Stone Sword key, so we could get into that little dungeon earlier, and I could run around and grab some stuff. I'm probably gonna die a lot. Oh, by the way, guys, I'm not really the best at this game. <clears throat> but, um, that is the plan right now. That is the plan. So I'm not sure yet, uh, what do you guys think I should use for a keepsake? Any ideas? Any ideas? Okay, um, you know, I'm going to try to move it forward, so what I think we're going to do is the Golden Seed would be the safest choice, right? Especially because I don't think I'm going to use any of the, um, the items in that dungeon now that I think about it. I could make do with a better Spirit Ash, but uh, should it shouldn't be too much of a problem. We're not going to start running around too hard and grabbing things because... I'm not sure what weapons I'm going to use and, and, you know, all the other stuff. So I think we'll just start start off like this. And if you guys want to see his uh, detailed appearance, his face. Uh, I don't know if I want to go into the body side. I kind of want to just get started with the game. I'm sorry, guys. If you guys want to see it, let me know. You know, we can look in the mirror uh, later on. I can uh, stream just the sliders later on and, and save them to YouTube or something like that if you guys want to see them. So, uh, with that said, let's go. Let's get started. Uh, he's Prophet class. We're going to do uh, Faith and Intelligence. I'm not sure how we're going to go about leveling it yet. We might go to Kaled early and get, you know, some of the sorcery stuff. You know, run around real quick. And, um, yeah. Let's get started, guys. Thanks for stopping by, by the way. <laughs> okay. Let's go. No, we are going to skip the intro. Uh, you know, it's been like, what, six, seven months already. So I'm sure everybody's seen it. I almost watched it, too. Uh, real quick, before we get started, I like to do this to get all these tutorial things out the way. While I have the chance. And uh, we'll do the messages. I also like to remove this. I use the quick menu a lot for my heals and my uh, horseback riding stuff like that, so that's probably going to be what I'm using it for. Here we are, guys. Trouble anticipation. Everybody's seen it. You know, everybody knows how it looks. Real quick, we have catch flame. We have heal. We have heal. We have catch flame. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to try to beat the uh, the Scion, the Grafted Scion. We might just try to kill him. Uh, might not be worth the time because the weapon we get, I'm not I'm not sure what weapon we're going to use. So, there's that. Uh, we'll give it a good old college try though, I guess. But you guys know the blessings on the floor are for people who have died in the game. A lot of the messages are from people who have died. Or, you know, they're giving you little warnings, things like that. Uh, real quickly before we do get started though, if you're having kind of a rough time with the game, 
Uh, you know, I'll be honest, the game is very unfair combat-wise, right? A lot of input rating, things like that. Um, leave messages on the floor if you can. You know, try to be helpful. Try to be funny. Uh, you know, while the game is still being played a lot, someone might appraise a message and you might get a, a Hail Mary heal. I know it's not something to count on. But it might be worth it in the long run, especially if you leave a lot of messages early on. Uh, not like this, though. This is a sh crap ton of messages. You know, if you're working on an HP regen build, definitely leave a lot of messages on the floor. Try to get the... Yeah. Try to get it going. I don't think I'm going to be able to beat this dude. What's my R2? Oh, bigger... Th oh, okay. But we will try. I kind of just trying to bait him into, like, a big move. Fortunately, that was a big whiff. Which sucks. Ugh. That really... <laughs> that really messed me up. So I don't think we're gonna beat him. Usually classes I could beat him with are like Bandit and, uh, you know, Samurai because I could throw arrows at him. It's a little rougher with these classes, for me at least. I know some people are, are gods at the game and uh, big ups, I guess. Yeah, that's about it. That's okay, guys. We're not here for all that. I like to run through that little mini tutorial at the bottom. Mostly just for a few extra souls so I could buy the, um, the crafting kit. So we're going to do that. And you don't have to, you won't die from just doing a straight drop. But let's uh, real quickly. HP, FP, that's where I like to have it on, on uh, the quick menu. We are playing on Xbox, by the way, guys, just so you know. Let's uh let's put that golden seed in. Let's get that extra extra flask. Uh there we go. I never really played with uh just a prophet, so Kinda of interesting. Uh, what's his short spear? I like the I like the double R two poke. Or uh, what do you want to call it? Heavy attack. I like the, the they call it charge attacks. I believe in this game, right? I like the charge attack. And we're just gonna grab all this stuff. They're not worth much, but uh. Quickly, I am not like a god at this game, clearly, as you can see, so... Uh, average at best. You won't be seeing any high tier gameplay. <laughs> uh, some forewarning, folks. Do you like the spear, though? Nice. We're kind of skipping through a lot of this, so, uh, you know, I'm sure all of you fans have seen it before. Let's not draw it out too much. I just need the, the meager amount of souls I'm getting. Well, well, that happened. Oh, we have a big boy heal.
I do indeed have a big boy here, my friends. Let's uh, let's fight this soldier. Give me the souls. Thank you. Okay, cool. How much have you said, guys? How much have you said, I know. Uh, you know, uh, guys, if you like chill streams and you like hanging out, just like hearing someone talk in the background, feel free to give me a follow. Guys, if you're watching on YouTube and you want to see what I'm all about, <laughs> There's a link in the description to my channel, so feel free to stop by, give me a follow. Uh, no pressure though, guys, no pressure. We're, we're still trying to grow this channel, so would appreciate it, but you know, you're not obligated to do anything you don't want to. Um, we'll just rest here, because I'm missing a little bit of HP. Not that it's going to matter, because there's another uh, side of grace up here. I'm not quite sure how we get to start leveling the build, right, uh, stat-wise. Let's just grab all this stuff real quick before we talk to, to Vi over there. Oh, yeah. Come to the uh, we gotta skip all this dialogue, guys. That's the castle he wants us to go to. He told me to move on. Let's make sure. Oh, yeah. So he wants me to get out of here, and we're gonna go ahead and get out of there. Get out of his hair. We might need these in for later. Like I said, I'm not quite sure what weapon we're gonna use to level up. You know, so I'm just gonna grab everything right now. Everything that looks appealing. Grab all this out the way. Uh, sorry, guys, I'm just cutting through a lot of it, but you know, I'm sure everybody's seen it before. I'm just grab the crafting kit real quick. And I like to just open those menus up real quick so we get all this stuff out the way. There we go. Make sure we touch this uh, side of grace. Okay, we're dead. Uh, let's take a look at our stats real quick. We start off as the prophet, guys. Uh, there we go. So if it's a prophet, we have the golden seed as the keepsake. We already used it. Um, we didn't really invest anything into our stats yet, so this is the stats we started out with. We're probably not really going to touch... Um, anything here. To my knowledge, folks. So, we're not gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna leave it for now. We'll probably get the HP up to 20 as a starting point. And, um, that's all I could think of. So. Mm. Let's move on. You shouldn't have too many problems with these beginning guys right there. They're just for you to uh, practice on, I guess. Right, you could do your R1 spams, you could do your pokes, you could do your heavy attacks. Uh, 
You know, they call it charge attacks in this game, but it's a heavy attack, guys. You know, you could do your right bumper, your R1, your your R2, your right trigger, whatever you want to call it. They're, they should be easy to defeat. And this is what I like to do when we start. I like to quickly get to this, you know, like I, I get the graces, I sit down at this one, get our horse, you know, get our mount, go back, talk to the witch, talk to the waifus. You know, you can, uh, you can definitely explore the camp and everything else if you want to. This is just, I like to quickly get these things. Just uh, we'll get out of here. The tar on, and then I think we'll um. Grab that map real quick. I don't want to get that guy's attention. We should be able to go back to the church. This way tarnished. May I have a word? A play and the whip. I'd hope tend upon look the talk I was to call forth. Ah, I was in trust by torrents. Tis a best summon their spirits now it is that. For I doubt we shall how long before the tar She's gone. Let's uh gonna put our spirit ashes on. And uh, we're all done here, right? Nothing nothing left to do. Now I know there's a whetstone in this um this camp right here, but I don't know I necessarily want to get it right now. We'll come back for it guys. I know I'm I know uh, if you're watching on YouTube, you'd be like, oh, you missed it. Or, uh, we'll come back for it. You don't really need it too much right now. We're more like grabbing, you know, all the things we could get real quick. But what I, what I will think we'll do is um, we'll change it to daytime because I don't want to deal with these, um, these dark riders, right? Uh... Not quite yet, we're not ready to take them on. You know, I say that and we're gonna to go to Kaled right away, so... Uh, whoops, my bad. You don't have to follow this to a T, right? Because I'm mostly... I'm kind of theorycrafting what we're going to get, what weapons we're going to get. Right now we have our beginner weapon, which is uh, the short spear. Uh, we're going to we're gonna take that trap over to Kaled after we grab the twin blade. And we're kind of just grabbing the twin blade just to grab it. I don't know if we're going to use it yet. Give him the praying to Agil. They want that dragon to come down and burn him up real nice. Make him crisp. Uh, unfortunately for them, I don't think that's going to happen right now. But very interesting. I wish they did more stuff like that in this game where you can hear them talking to themselves, you know. But. There we 
we have the twin blade. I guess if you guys want to see it, we can take a look at it real quick. I don't have the stats for it. There's a twin blade. We do have a, a shield now that I've noticed. Especially the shield real quick. It's a rickety shield though. They really uh, screwed this prophet over, like in uh, the lore, right? And they gave him tattered robe, rickety shield, sent him out on his way. At least they gave him a spear. They could have just gave him nothing. And uh, some of the most dangerous enemies in the game is right here, these rats. Totally broke my guard. Okay. Like I said, we're not. I'm trying not to fight them too much because I'm gonna die anyway pretty soon. <clears throat> you see, we're already having issues. Okay. There you go. We're gonna go places we're not supposed to be, guys. We're probably gonna die here. We're gonna get hit with a sticky web. Mm. But I do want that staff just to, you know, just in case, so. I'm gonna get it. That's what we're gonna, that's the plan, guys. You see, we're inside the crystal tunnel. We gotta try our best to not get hurt, but more than likely. <laughs> more than likely, we're gonna get hit by that. And that guy's still following us for some reason. Can't even sit down at it. Can't even sit down. And uh, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, uh, the game is very empathy. It's a very unfair game. Uh, I think it's a lot of fake difficulty they put in just for the sake of it. I don't really agree with it. Oh, with that said, I do still play this game a lot. Obviously, I do like it. We're playing it right now, but uh, I do think it's a very unfair game. I think it's extremely unfair. Oh, we might want to spend some points, huh? Uh, we'll just put into Vigor, because that's the safest point to put it, uh, to invest into right now. Well, the safest stat to invest into. For the moment, just because we're trying to move on. I don't want to lose these souls. <clears throat> I don't want to lose these runes, excuse me, guys. Uh, you know, it's, it's not Dark Souls, but but it is. All right, I don't want to lose that stuff. Um, now we're in Swamp Aeonia. Or Aeonia, or, you know, Aeonia. Whatever you want to say, guys, it's all the same. I said we're working on something very specific here, so we're just getting a couple tools, some carry stuff, right? Hopefully we didn't get followed too hard. There's Rockslane, guys. There's the spammy meteor spell. For those of you guys that want to know where it's at, you did get followed. Okay, luckily we're fine. There's the Traveler set if you guys want the Traveler set.
There's the meteor stuff. There's that. Now we should be able to get out of here. Okay. So we need to work on our intelligence. And now, guys, if you want, you can come back and do all this stuff here. You know, grab the whetstone, clear the camp out. I am liking this short spear. I like the combo. It's not going to do us any favors uh, in a big group, though, but it is what it is right now. Did we grab the other, um, did we grab that up weapon back there? I don't think we did. There you go, guys. There's the flail. I think we'll wait for that guy with the horn to out face. There we go. You don't have to do all this in the order I'm doing it on, uh, guys. You know you can do it. You can take these enemies on however you want. I'm just really trying to clear out as many as I can before I summon um, our spirit ashes. Which uh, we're gonna do pretty soon. Not quite yet, though. I think we should take out this guy at the horn. Or the trumpet, whatever you want to call it. Let's go ahead and let's get him before he calls everybody. Uh, we might get lucky and get a brass shield, hopefully. I know he saw that, but he's a big dum dum, so he'll just continue on with his day. It must be the wind. Must be the wind, huh? And then around this point, I'm usually uh, comfortable with summoning my spirit ashes. Which is what I think we will do right now. Uh, We did get tagged off screen by the wolf, but there you go. I usually do wait a little bit longer to heal, but since we are uh, very bare bones right now, my armor is very, very light. I didn't want to get his attention, but. I would like for them to get more aggro. Thank you, sirs. There you go. Okay. And uh, I think we are clear it out. Definitely looks like it. 
You see, we didn't get too lucky. And uh, we'll leave our good boys over there. So I know we need to work on our intelligence, right? But we will work on our vigor a little bit. We're definitely going to need it. So, we'll meet him again later. But for now, let's, uh, there is a cookbook over here. Uh, you know, like I said, you guys can level up however you want. Uh, usually I do run around and grab a bunch of stuff that I absolutely need first, right? A lot of the easier stuff. But being as I don't know what weapon I want and things like that, we're just going to grab stuff that I know is useful uh, for starting out. Try to avoid most of these enemies here. Are you gonna skip the beetle? Or are we gonna get him? Excuse me guys, I don't use the spear too much to especially from horse back. No, you know what? I changed my mind. Because I'd rather not get comboed off this this mount. We'll come back for it, guys. Let's just do, uh... Let's just do what we're supposed to do here. I know there's a point of grace close by. I feel like I might have missed it. Oh, there it is. And uh, like I said, guys, uh, we're really not sure. I'm really not sure how the build is going to end up uh, quite yet. Right? I'm not sure how we're going to build it, how we're going to level everything up. So uh, this is a work in progress, definitely. Uh, we're just trying to skip this, this troll. And I know the church is right there, but there's an actual war over here that I feel like we should definitely grab. Ah, crap. So we have Sacred Blade. That should fail. Uh, fail. Scale with faith. I'm pretty sure, right? It's, it is, uh... We'll take a look at it right now. Actually, here's the church, guys. There, Church America. You want to grab your your physics? Your sacred tier. You want to grab all that good stuff? And we don't really have good physics right now, but we will have our flask. We're not going to listen to to Miss Wife or Lady. Uh, we'll mix our physic. There's nothing really there, but uh, it's better than nothing. Ah, oh, crap. I forgot to do the Ash War stuff. I'm sorry. Let's, uh, let's sit back down. Wait, what? Did I forget to get the whetstone, guys? Yeah, 
Methinks me forgot to get the, the whetstone. Which is okay. We'll run back in there real quick and grab it. That was my fault. I'm so sorry. I believe I cleared everything out and then we forgot to get it. So uh, let's do the thing real quick. We should be okay because we don't really have any uh, points to, to waste any runes. Definitely forgot to get it. There you go, guys. Easy, quick. Uh, we'll go back to the church. Uh, we'll bring it. We'll make it. Um, no, we'll leave it. We'll leave it at the time of day. It is that. Uh, ashes of war. Sacred. There you go. There you go, guys. Now we have sacred blade. Now we have some some holy, whatever you want to call it, sacred. The buff doesn't last too long, to, uh, to be honest with you guys. Right there it goes. Our toothpick is already non-golden. Um. What we will do is, what I think we'll do is, we'll, <clears throat> we'll grab the map. Grab the cookbook. Well, I want to grab the cookbook. There we go. Don't come around to the minor earth tree. Grab the tears. Uh, hmm. Actually, you know, there's a there's a beetle around here with the butt stop. Not that we're gonna use it, but I don't want to forget about him. Because once I move on, I'm more than likely not gonna come back. Or I I do forget a lot. I know he has um some stuff, but. Oh wait, I think it's over there actually, the beetle. Okay, we'll come back for you guys. We'll just grab the points of grace, we'll grab the golden seeds, we'll do it, you know, we'll do all the stuff. do think we are going to do is we're going to take that teleporter and we're going to grab the other golden seed <clears throat> we don't have a bleed weapon so we're not going to be doing the dragon trick anytime soon but I do want to increase my flask count while I can hmm. considering if I actually want to do it or not Let's do it. Let's just let's just do it, shall we? And this is where we're at on the map. Very far away. Very bloodborne. I am a fan of this location here.
Uh, you do not want to get hit by these dudes. They are nasty, so we're going to do our best to not get hurt. I think they're called militiamen. They're lean, mean militiamen, if I remember right. Do not get hit by them. And this is the route you want to go if you want to get your sword seal, you know, all that kind of stuff. We're just going to go around just to have these points of grace unlocked. Hopefully this dragon doesn't kill us. Okay. Okay, we're good. Like I said, guys, I'm not sure how long we're going to do this uh, play in particular. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to continue it on, on Twitch or anything like that. Uh, if you guys like it, let me know and... You know, if I'm still playing it offline, I will try to do as much gameplay as I can online. Uh, like I said, I don't even know if this build is going to be a thing. We're kind of just working on stuff, seeing what's, what I can do with it. There's four tires right there. Side of races right here, guys. Now, when you rest here, Melana's gonna talk to you, or Melona, however you want, to, whatever you want to pronounce her name as. Uh, I usually don't go to the round table right away. Forgive me to determine if you have. It seems torrent, whereas I may. There is, but I can take gathering place. Okay, and uh, from here you can do kind of whatever you want. You can go over there and grab, uh, you know, you can do the dragon thing if you want, if you have a blade weapon. Uh, you can come around here and grab these, uh, I think this one right here, there's the map there, which I do kind of want to grab real quick. I don't know if Mommy Dragon wakes up. Uh, but we'll leave it our own devices right now. So that's what she do, guys. I do believe at one point she had a full move set, but she was so big that they, I think it like broke the game or whatever. Like I said, we're just trying to grab the uh, <laughs> the waypoints, not the waypoints. I'm sorry, guys, the maps. Which I think I uh, actually am a little off from it. <clears throat> yep, yep, yep. That is what we wanted right there. Okay. So you do still have a couple options. Um, we don't have the runes for it uh, just yet, but there is a, a shop over here, I believe. And you could grab this um, side of grace if you want. Try not to aggro any of these uh, T-Rex dogs. If 
if you can help it. I know it's hard to not do sometimes. They kind of have a mind of their own. But if you can help it, No, what the shack is really great for is um Well, has been how can I help? He sells this torch over here. Beast repellent torch, and it makes everything passive around here. Uh sometimes it works really well, sometimes it just doesn't work it some seems like. But as long as you have it on your offhand, even if you're mounted, uh these dogs they'll leave you alone for the most part. So it's good to come back and get once you have the uh the runes for it. I don't think I have enough. We'll, we'll check. Honestly, I should be using these runes for um, leveling. Anything. But we'll grab the uh, we'll grab the torch. And then uh, test it out. We'll test it out. So there it is, right? Uh, moment of truth. Usually, if they see you, they will get aggro right away, right? There we are. They stay away for the most part, as you can see. He really wants to kill me. That ram really wants to headbutt me, too. But they don't. Unfortunately, we don't have the points for it, so we can't really do anything. Um, so you have a lot of this map complete already. Very cool. And uh, like I said, guys, I'm not sure what weapon we're going to use. I'm not sure what's a good leveling up weapon, right? Uh, as much as I've played this game. For this build in particular, I'm not sure what weapon I want to use. Uh, we're going to make it morning time again. I really can't afford to... For it to be nighttime right now. So if you're in Kaelin and you're having a hard time with those dogs, everything like that, you you know, you can grab that very quickly as you can see. We are, we're not even that far into the game. Maybe 40 minutes in, and you know, that was me standing around a lot of the time, too. Okay, we already did touch that, just making sure. Now, as far as these guys go, the guys that live in death, uh, I mean, I guess we could test the, um, let's grab this. Freaking beat is a I really don't want to deal with this this damn dragon fly right now, so we're not gonna but as you can see works really well. As long as it's uh, buffed up, they will not come back. And you guys know why we're buffing it. We're about to get an evader. I mean, while we're restoring our, our FP, HP, blah, blah, blah. No, he'll probably kill me. I get him just to walk into this poke forever and ever. Which seems like he might want to do. Okay. 
he somehow saw me doing that, which I'm uh, not a fan of. But you get ahead of him. Okay. Duvia, we'll talk to our buddy real quick. Just join the wild. You fought Narius and survived. I'm Yura. Tarnished. How do you stay the path? Just remember. Don't know your emotions. One last word of you. Stay clear of Agil Lake. And it's just so. Stay clear. So he wants me to not go to the lake. Not not fight the dragon. I don't know if we'll fight him or not. Probably not. Not right now. You don't need to worry about uh, if you can't like use this torch attack or not, right? Because we're not using it for that; we're using it for the light. So it shouldn't be an issue. Uh, the the plan right now is to get uh, our vigor to twenty. That is the plan, at least, guys. And I'm being a little cautious because uh, the game loves to get cheap hits out on you. Definitely does. No, there's nothing in here. So I guess the guys lost their damn mind. I'm trying to quit, uh, keep our equip low pretty small right now. Actually, I don't think even I even had gloves, did I? No, I didn't. I had basically nothing on. Now, here's the thing, guys. I'm not sure if having no gear on is better than having like very light gear i'm gonna assume no because you then you have no defense right you're gonna want at least a little bit of defense so <clears throat> why don't we just put on the traveler stuff right think about it like that uh you you will be lighter right but the even the small amount of uh damage negation just goes down to zero right so it's better to have something on Now, if you guys are cosplaying, I, I get it completely, I understand. So, up to you. And he hits really hard, too. <laughs> he did it back. Okay. It's funny, I actually have no idea what that is, that status right there. And I don't plan on figuring it out either. Mm -hmm. I knew you would. 
I'll bring my attack down. I see. I'll forgive him. It's patches after all. And uh, we can just teleport. Like I said, we gotta work on our vigor first. Uh, health is important in this game, guys. For me, at least, I think it's one of the most important stats you can have. Uh, we're gonna get that to 20. And I uh, do stand by what I said. Uh, game does get a lot of cheap hits out on you. You got to be ready for that, guys. It's uh, some people be like get good and stuff like that, but I I think it's poor game design to to have input reading in games. It's very '90s arcade style stuff to, you know, get a cheap quarter out of you, kind of things. Well, nice you want to be and welcome. You won't be... uh, about the bandits, uh, you know, we're just exhausting dialogue. Basically, the chest. There's a chest right there, guys. You can see over my shoulder. Just something I'm but then again, can be signed. Gonna grab that cookbook. Uh, you do want to make those gold pickled fowl for as many as you can make. For that. And for the sake of it, we will open this chest. Guys, if you don't do this, you're going to miss out on an emote, just letting you guys know, and you'll have to get into New Game Plus to get there, so, uh, up to you. Vengeance! <laughs> okay. He's such a little shit. <laughs> what, a good, what a good guy he is, huh? And he really tries to get us killed, too. He's not playing around, but luckily for us, I know exactly where we're at. And like I said, guys, I know I'm passing by a lot of stuff. Right there is the, uh... There's Blythe. There's, uh, there's a talisman over there, too, guys, but we'll come back for that later. I don't think we need it exactly yet. And we're just going to the point of grace, basically. Now you're there, you could go right back to Patches. Uh, you might want to do this sooner than later because you might forget to talk to him again, and then he'll move his shop. And I do believe um, you have to get the emote here. I could be wrong, guys. If I am wrong, let me know. And feel free to, you know, you can farm these guys for their outfits. Their legs are not, uh, hold on, we'll take a look at their items in a minute. So, as far as I know, you know, this is Highwayman Gauntlets. Their hood is Highwayman like chest piece, right? I mean, their their chest is like Highwayman chest piece, right? They have a Highwayman hood, but their legs are not Highwayman legs. They, those are that's from another set, so they don't wear a complete set. Just to, just some forewarning, guys, in case you guys do like farming for items, like I do, right? For like armor sets, there's no full Highwayman set. The legs built in, as far as I know, at least. Uh, 
and like I said, a lot of cheap shots, guys. A lot of ultra delayed moves for some reason. I was locked on, but I didn't hit him. You know. And I know people would be like, "Oh, but the arc, blah blah blah." Stop it. Luckily, um, oops. You know, we do have some miracles or incantations, as you want to guys guys want to call them. We have some faith healing spells, so we should be okay for the most part. Does have a point. View it as a learning experience. And anyway, it's just nice to see you safe. Oh, don't miss all the bargains here. And there's the emote bottom right hand side, guys. Calm down. That's uh, that is the emote. Cheers for that. Now, like I said, you can either um, you can just stop here and farm for items. It's up to you. Uh, I think we'll do it one last run because I kind of want the uh, the hood. Uh, let's just make sure that this doesn't. You know, sometimes they have like those little hidden attributes where they add focus or things like that. Oh wait, that that is not what I had on. Right, that was uh, that's something we had on when we went to Kaylee. We'll do one last little run here. Like I said, you, you don't have to do any of this stuff, right? Completely up to you guys. You can see I was trying to hit our buddy there before he do his poison pot at me. Sometimes it's just none in the works. Okay. We won't uh, we won't dwell on it too much. Let's uh let's move on. Uh be wary of these traps guys. When you're coming in like this, right, there's a trap right here. Trap right here. If you hit it. Rings a bell, everybody comes running. Uh, I mean, if you have the strength to kill them all together, you know, you might have a nice spell that, that rips through everybody. Uh, feel free to use it. <clears throat> like I said, we're going to get Vigor up to 20, first of all. That's our first goal. And then we'll move on from there. And uh, there's a couple things you can do here, guys. You can, um... There's a dungeon back here. I don't really remember this every and everything. I kind of just do stuff. My brain turn off real good. So... Uh, with that said, there is dungeon here. Uh, it will be frustrating sometimes. Well, I get frustrated easily, right? So... Uh, ignore these little slimes, whatever you want to call them, these flesh, fleshy blobs on the floor. Which is uh, funny. These are these are probably just tarnished, or uh, not tarnished, right? <clears throat> you know, everybody can't die here, but that doesn't mean they can't decay and, and decompose, right? So those are probably just people that can't die and they turn into nice little jellies. Uh, yeah, you gotta be cautious here, guys. There's some imps, some cat mains over here. There's one up there that I, I really want to get, but... Seems like he doesn't want to come down just yet. There he is. Try not to be directly beneath him because he does do a dropping attack.
Well, I was trying to be uh, slick, but I guess not. Let's let's back up a little bit, just because I don't want to deal with that. <sighs> hold on, hold on, hold on. Relax, guys, please. Let's just make our life easy. Sit down. Whew, take a quick breather. Everything's okay. Uh, do I have any points to level up? Nope. Okay. Excuse me one second, folks. Okay. Uh, like I said, guys, uh, even me knowing they're all there, as you can see, didn't really help. Because I knew all these enemies were here, it's just a matter of uh, dealing with them all. This enemy doesn't want to drop down quite yet. As you can see, even with that knowledge, I think that is it for these guys. We'll just make sure I know. I did forget about him. Oh, that's right. still. I do believe they could drop their um their helmets. And they do throw their daggers, right? But he's the one I want to deal with here. Which is why I do hit this. <laughs> you can see it's time to time to screw me on my victory. And come right in. What's up? Nope. Guess I just grabbed that item over there. I know you can do this, sir. And he's in a corner, so we'll just poke into that. There you go. And there's the door, guys. And uh, you can see there's a shadow, <laughs> a white shadow fighting something over here. I wonder what it is. I wonder what it could possibly be. What could be giving them all these problems, I guess?
Okay. Now that we're done with that. <laughs> try skill. Try blood loss. What does this one have to say? Try summoning, of course. Uh, seek pickle. Okay. Fair enough, guys. Fair enough. Let's, uh... I'm a big fan of that hoodie hat on. Are you serious? <laughs> okay. Probably gonna die here. I have a heavy suspicion. I mean, maybe if uh, we'll tag him a little bit. Instead of running around to his face, waiting for me to die. Sir? Feel free to get a hit out. I know I'm doing a lot of running right now, but I kind of have to. Especially, look, he's not even... Like, his stamina is definitely right. <sighs> you kind of lucked it out. You kind of lucked it out. But, um... Yeah. As you can see, even my ashes were just... <laughs> even my ashes are working against me at that, that point in time, huh? We did make it through though. Uh, very lucky. Very, very lucky. Um, I do kind of want to make sure that we got all like the, uh, the glove ward and all that stuff for it to uh, level up our spirit ashes. So we'll take a quick look around. Okay. Avoid the trap. I yeah, sure would be sad if we die to that. At this point in time. Okay. Like I said, we're just making sure we got all the... All the materials here. Ooh, and it's okay to sit down. And with that done, uh, we're mostly done here. There's a... Uh, there's a cave here to, to get some materials to level up your weapons if you guys need it. Dragon around here-ish somewhere. Oh, the dragon's around here, guys. I'm sorry. Of course. Dragon is around here somewhere. Um, if you guys want, you can start heading south. Right, uh, what you could do is, if you've heard the howling, come back to the church. And talk to Kali. You can talk about the howling in Misswood. He says he heard somebody, he'll give you an emote. Uh, we'll do that next. Most importantly, make sure you have the emote on. 
There it is, finger snap. And also, guys, like I said, you can level this build up however you want. I mean, you know, I don't know if you're following this. Uh, I don't know why you would follow this build. Um, I usually just get Vigor to 21st uh, for most of my builds, I think, is probably one of the more important stats you could have. I'm kind of like bypassing a lot of the stuff that you usually would want to get in the game, right? We're kind of just getting stuff that I know I want right now. Go back to when you hear the howling. So he's looking for Dorawo, and if you guys want to know where he's at, uh, we'll go over to him right now, actually. Which is funny, because, uh, you know, he asks you to, to, to let him know where he's at, right? But I guess he finds him first, and then he gives you a reward anyway. Which it would have been nice if there's an option to, like, spot the jail he's in, because he's in a jail. And then come back and tell him. Which I guess it was a step... Uh, they wanted to omit, right, because it was just an extra... You know, it takes extra time. Go over there, come back, snap your fingers, he comes back down, you tell him. Then you both go back to the same spot to fight him. I guess that is kind of a lot to do. Now we could ignore all these guys. No big deal. You can you can feel free to fight them if you want or not. And uh, you know you can grab this point of grace too. There's no harm in getting it, so you might as well. And um, also, I know we haven't been grabbing weapons and uh, a lot of things for the the build because I know we're working on it. Right, I still gotta I still gotta get my theory crafting out there. We're kind of just in a leveling up process before I start figuring out weapons and staffs and uh, talismans I want to use. So maybe when I do have them fully fleshed out, I'll come back and I'll show them off a little bit. Uh, this is going to be more PvP focused, I think. He's ready. He's ready to throw down. Here's our buddy here. Uh, he really mops the floor with him too. If he can touch him. There you go. But we will help him out a little bit. I mean, he usually mops the floor with him. There we go. And I really can't afford to get hit too much.
So I really can't get afford to get hit too much. I'm wearing very light armor. My my health is very very low too. Okay. Right. There you are. Not to work for it, but it's done. Don't say I'm not a man of my word. Oh yes. If you venture north to Rea Lucaria and come across a venerable blacksmith, tell him I sent you, and he'll be sure to treat you. I owe you one, I reckon. So. There we go. And then he's gonna tell us. This time we parted way. To leave, so. We'll leave. We'll leave him alone. We'll leave our best friend alone. And we should be able to level up again now that we have that. Um. Like I say, guys, as far as weapons and things like that, I'm really not sure. The spirit, this is okay, but I don't like the fact that we don't have kind of a a left to right kind of like a swiping, a swiping hit. We, you could go for the partisan if you like have your heart set on a spear kind of weapon. Right, you could, you could get a partisan and uh, let's make it daytime. Okay, I guess like I was saying, you could get a partisan. The only person I know that drops a partisan this early is this uh, this knight over here. With his big spear. And that is not a spear. Not this knight, right? Mind you guys, we'll, we'll take care of him though. Mostly because he saw us. Him right here. And we'll see if we can luck out and pick it up. Nope. We lucked out and got the gauntlets. <laughs> and uh, you don't really, you don't really have to fight everybody there, right? The minute he brings that bow, you can come back and um, just sit down. I will fight him one more time just to see if it drops. Um, I I don't know about the drop rates in this game. They seem like they're pretty low for the most part. I don't know. You could also fast travel elsewhere and pick them up. That hurt. We're just trying to power through, basically. That's all we're doing right now. Like I said, sometimes everything seems to work against you, right? Like, as you can see, my spirit ashes not being aggressive as they usually are. And uh, he didn't drop it this time. We'll kill this knight though, because I do, I do need like a shield. Nothing. Okay. Okay, guys. We won't do that, but we will kill him and see if he drops his shield. Unfortunately, you know. Right, right, right. And with that said, you did grab a bunch of items here, right? So they are kind of uh, forgiving. Right, we did get the lower sword and great sword uh, earlier. Uh, depends on your stats, though. As you can see, we barely have the stats for anything. Right? They dropped a... Uh, there was a flail. Right? There was a flail. There was the, the great sword there. So you, they do give you a couple options if you guys want to try them out. You know, as, as well as your starting weapon, which... Uh, 
<clears throat> they do give you smithing stones, so you could level that up a little bit. I would advise against it, honestly. Unless you know you could be using that weapon for a really, really long time. And if you know that, then you might as well have at it. But, um, I would advise against the folks. I'm kind of just backtracking so I could get my, my ashes out. Unfortunately, this happens sometimes. You can do a bunch of jumping attacks. As you can see, he didn't drop it though. Um, we'll do it like one more time just because I kind of want the partisan. We'll also come and see if he can get a shield. Oh. Dropped a whole lot of nothing. We'll do one more, also because I have a point I can spend, right? So we might as well just... I do believe in a point I can spend. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Nothing wrong with it. Just be careful, guys. I mean, you could start up with him. If you want. Once he he's going to be annoying. It's a big guy, I'm afraid. And he might drop his shield as well. Well, we drew some unwanted attention. I forgot to switch my spear. That was my fault. Totally my fault that time. You see, that didn't do me any favors. We actually died there, which uh, didn't expect to happen. But we'll do the last uh, Grace Visitor because we're very close, so I don't think it matters too much. I think we'll just go ahead and get him out the way real quick. Of course, we're left to fend for ourselves right now, which sucks. Especially because, as you can see, As good as your spells are, they have to land for them to mean anything. I mean, you could totally do this, right? Kind of poke him, let him do his thing. See, we're really working hard for it, too. Really working hard for it. But, uh, nope. Not that time. That's it, we have it since 20. Cool. And I think, um, we'll actually just do one more. This time for real. One more for real this time. Okay, guys, one more. We'll draw him back a little bit. Okay. 
So I guess we got nothing. The the next best thing we can do is probably fight him. And uh, you know, you can farm these guys for their shields, for their armor. Uh, there's a brass shield that they dropped is pretty good. You don't have to, but you know, definitely an option. Definitely an option, guys. Especially if you don't know what you're gonna wear, which uh, I really don't. I'm not sure what we're gonna end up wearing. their armor uh like i said uh drop rates i'm not too sure on equip load that's going to be up to you to figure out your equip load things like that the guys that drop the shields are the ones that have them as well right so he'll have the shield if they're allowed to drop it Crap. I totally ruined everything there, but... Should be too much of an issue. Well, usually it's not too much of an issue. Your wolves usually take care of a lot by themselves. But as you can see, they know I'm streaming right now, and they want to cut. And since I'm not giving them anything, they decided to take a fall. All right, let me check out what we got. Bolts. Bolts, of course. How about you guys? Anything? No pull out of nothing. They left. Uh, they left one of their buddies alive for me to kill. I think all he has is a sword on him. And I guess since we're here, we'll just take care of him. Oh, I think he came running. Okay. Okay. Well, there you have it, guys. Um, if you don't want to do all that, there is a defender over here, right? And we could take a look at him real quick. Like, say you need a shield, right? Right? Like, a quick shield. Since we did come over here anyway, you do got um, you do remember there was a vendor over here in this forest, and you could definitely backtrack to him. I do believe he saws a shield. Hopefully, I'm right, and I don't look like an idiot on stream. Yes, yes, yes. And there's a shield right there. He has another shield as well. Uh, you know, if you're starting out as a prophet, you do kind of... Uh, you have a rickety shield, right? It doesn't do much physical negation. There you go. As you can see, I can't even wear it yet. We gotta get our strength up. You're gonna need uh, talismans, especially with the build I'm going for. Uh, we should probably talk about what I want to do with the build, right? Why don't we... Hmm. Let's check something real quickly. Okay. Alright. <clears throat> so let's talk about what I want to do with the build. I'm using a calculator here, guys, so... I want to get my Vigor to 50, my... my uh, Intelligence and Faith to 45, so I can use a Talisman to boost them up. Probably like Marika's Source Heal. Uh, strength Index are probably going to be kept at base. The Dex might be a little bit higher. Right, most of the Strength Index are probably going to come from... Um, talismans. 
uh, more than likely. So what I do think we're gonna do actually, even better idea, is since we did pop by Fort Farrow, we'll go ahead and grab a Sword of Seal, which is kind of a band-aid for now. Now, you're more than likely, especially if you're coming in here with the level I'm at, you're gonna die. But you know, you could definitely run up here, grab the, uh, grab the medallion half if you want. Right, and drop down. Uh, be careful because there are some dolls here. I believe these are dolls. Come down to the right hand side. Drop down. Come around here. Crack these. Uh, crack that wood. Pop over here. Be careful because there is a big, big rat. And he does want to kill. So. Ah, grab Radagon Sword Seal. Then you are in combat, guys, so there's not much you could do. Except get lucky and teleport back. Usually you can just die. The rat will drop down and he'll try to eat you real good. So, uh, there's that. Um, hmm. Okay, so we have that. So now we should be able to wear, you know, uh, a regular shield. That's uh, let's do some inventory management, shall we? Um, hmm. what should we do? So you know you can have your shield here, now we can wear it. Uh you can have your your finger seal here. You can you know you don't gotta put it in this order. You can put your finger seal up here on the right hand side too if you want. Um Can't you do anything with the spells yet? You know you can upgrade your armor a little bit, try to keep your equip load not too high, not too not too short. You know you can start upgrading your armor if you want. Just make sure you're wearing something, right? Because you're gonna need some defense. Uh, you, you can use medium armor as well. You know, it's all up to you. It's all fashion cells at this point. So it's really whatever you want to wear, guys. And um, I'll, I will be honest, I do really want that partisan. So I think we'll do one more. We'll do one more shot at it. And I'm not really a fan of uh get a little more defense going. And still roll. Okay. And I really want to spend the whole stream farming, but it's not fun, right? So we'll do one last run. And whether I get it or not, we might end the stream and I'll work on it. I'm offline for a little bit. And if you guys like this, because I will upload it to YouTube. Feel free to let me know. Oh, uh, you know, if you guys want to see more, whatever.
going to take this guy out quietly. Because we don't want him to ring that horn or to blow the horn. So we take him out. Nice and simple like that. Everything but, huh, guys? Everything but it, but that's okay. Uh, like I said, you, you can feel free to level up your armor and stuff like that. I mean, you know, farm the armor. Maybe we'll get lucky and they drop a, a brass shield. Maybe we'll get lucky and hit them as well. The brass shield is slightly heavier than we might. I'm sorry, I felt like some lag coming in, so... Uh, the brass shield is slightly heavier than this, to my knowledge, so we might not even want it. But since we're here farming everybody, we might as well kill them and see if they drop anything, right? Maybe he'll drop his uh, shield. Guys, I think we will uh, wrap things up here. I uh, I will work on the build offline a little bit. Um, if you're watching on YouTube and you like what you see, and if you want to see me actually complete this build, uh, you know, and show it off, because I I'm gonna work on it. Um, feel free to let me know in the comments if you guys want to see me use the build on um, Twitch. Like I said, feel free to let me know in the comments, guys. If you like what you see, feel free to give me. A follow uh, on t on Twitch, a subscription on YouTube. You know, uh, let me know in the comments what you guys want to see. I play a variety of games, guys. Uh, Alden Ring, DC Universe. Um, my name, the names escape me. <laughs> oh no, the names escape me. Diablo, uh, Diablo two and three. We can play Diablo two and three. A variety of games, guys. We can play Black Desert. Uh, a lot of games, open to everything. So, let me know what you guys want to see. I'll be back later on, guys. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Frank Gallows, guys. Uh, like I said, feel free to give me a follow. I'll see you guys later. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye-bye. Hey!